Hey YouTube, real quick, um, this is an addendum to my previous video about the Zufonium. I want to do kind of a sound comparison between this and my Yamaha E42. So I'm going to play um, the first part of the b solo from Pictures at an Exhibition on both. I'll play it on this first. Um, this horn plays really, really well. The high range is especially good. And it really has that British chord of the sound that I really love. And we'll see if that comes across whatsoever. There you go guys, just a little sound quality comparison um, from my ears, being under the instrument, behind the instrument. It's super weird going back and forth because the sound on the Besson is going that way. It feels a little like trombone on the wrong side of the body. On this, the sound is only in your right ear going that way off the wall and stuff, which really throws me. This takes a lot more air to play. I'm using a lot larger mouthpiece, basically a bass trombone mouthpiece on this whereas I'm using a Dennis Wick 4AL on the other instrument. Um, the high range centers and just kind of projects and comes out much more easily on the Besson than it does on this. Um, this takes a lot more air, a lot more focus, a lot more thought. Um, on this instrument, I do go for more of a tenor tuba sound, just a little kind of beefier than your standard British euphonium sound. So part of that is my sound concept, but there you go. Um, hopefully you guys glean something out of that. Hopefully it doesn't just sound bad and out of tune like it probably does. See you guys next time.